Chicago, the Raptors are one of a handful of NBA teams no longer doing business with hotels owned by United States President Donald Trump. According to a story published by the Washington Post and confirmed by Raptors officials, the team will no longer stay in the Trump Soho Hotel when on the road in New York City. We talked about it, talked about where we're staying. It was a decision made by us, and a lot of teams in the league, Raptors coach Dwayne Casey said after the team worked out in Toronto on Thursday. Casey wouldn't say where the Raptors will stay during three trips to the metropolitan New York area this season, citing security concerns and following a long held organizational policy. There's reasons behind it, but we're not going to announce where we are staying, he said. The Post story said 12 NBA teams had stayed at the luxurious Manhattan Hotel since it opened in 2010 and 11 have stopped using it. The Raptors, the newspaper said, were among five teams to end its relationship with the property this season. Toronto has three trips to the New York City area this season, a November 17 game in New York, a January 8 game in Brooklyn and a March weekend where they play both the New York Knicks and the Brooklyn Nets on the same road trip. The Post surveyed 123 teams in various North American professional sports leagues to see how many use Trump properties on the road. Of the 105 responses the paper got, no teams confirmed they stated facilities owned, and now in trust, by the American president.